Angel Shifters. So today is day one, officially, of <laughs> the Shift Happens Challenge. And this morning was really, actually really good. I got up um, at about 5.45 and I do morning prayers. So I didn't actually go out and, and work out until about 6.15. 620. So it's not that I was unfamiliar with these exercises, but I tell you, when I got to those Russian twists, I was good the first set. I was all good. I was on top of it. Then um, <laughs> I saw the next set and I was like, oh, wow. So I didn't get the full, I think it was supposed to be 40 or something like that. I think I did 30, 10 off. But I was actually really good. I thought it was really great. What's interesting is I like to ice skate and I've always liked that whole speed skating thing like I totally wish I would have gotten into that right but anyway so I decided I was gonna add glides to my workout when you do glides you look like you are skating and what I do is I take styrofoam plates and instead of um Stepping on the part that you would usually eat, I flip them over because it's smoother, right? Like I got, oh. <laughs> anyway, you flip them over and it's smoother so you can glide really easily. And so I started doing those. You do, um, I'm doing about 30 and then I'll keep adding to them. So it was actually really good. My legs are a little bit sore. I did stretch. I know that I'm gonna have to add some type of exercise for my back because my back is really weak and I could tell that when I was doing those Russian twists. Those things are a bear. I'm also going to add in jumps, like jump rope. Probably about 400. I used to do about 400 per day. So I'll start there and then start adding them. Um, I usually add like 100 per week. So we'll see. Maybe I'll be up to 800 by the time this whole thing is over. I do want to share what it is that I'm eating and drinking. Mostly drinking right now. <laughs> Mostly drinking. So I do two different juices. I take what's called um, liquid glucosamine and chondroitin, which is actually good for your joints. I have always, I've had bad knees since I was in eighth grade. I've had patella tendonitis, which is jumper's knee, played basketball and volleyball tended not to wear knee pads in volleyball. Not very smart, but it was fun while it lasted. <laughs> um, and I've also sprained the knee, so um, I always have to be careful of that. So I take liquid glucosamine and chondroitin every day. It's a citrus flavor. It's not good. They'll try to say that it is, but it's not. So I mix that in with my carrot juice not just plain carrot. So I do a carrot, pineapple, banana, and then there's one other thing, carrot, pine oh, and mandarin, mandarin orange. So I do three mandarin oranges. I'll put the recipe down at the bottom so you can have that. And then I also do a kale, which I do in the evenings generally. Um, sometimes instead of vegetables, I'll just drink that since it has, um, I have kale, pineapples, carrots, and I drop in dates, which is good for sweetening. Pretty good stuff, I must say. For breakfast, I have oatmeal. Now, the most fun, okay. Today is April Fools. And I said last week that I was gonna get my son. My son is 14 and he loves to eat. So I decided I was going to do the little Oreos trick, the little Oreos, and I put, um, I opened the Oreos and put toothpaste in it. Thank goodness we don't do those crazy colored toothpastes and whatnot. However, it went over smashingly because oftentimes when he comes home, I have a snack for him, something for him to eat. And he was really excited to see these cookies. Mm. I almost couldn't hold in my delight. And then he ate one and he ate another one 
And then he got to the third one. It's called lulling him. I couldn't make it the first one. And when he got to that one, <laughs> I probably shouldn't laugh like this, but it's hilarious. So he, <laughs> I saw him looking at it at first. And then because he's a boy, he's like, it doesn't really matter. Put it in his, <laughs> he put it in his mouth, right? And starts chewing and chewing and kind of chewing. And then he went, and I couldn't help it. I lost it. And he said, what? <laughs> Best April Fool's ever, ever. Here's a little bit of it. What did you say? I said there's snack for you. Thank you. What's wrong? Nothing. Nothing. How was your day? It was good. Finishing the paper. Whoa. Hmm. That's so wrong. I know exactly that you do. That's not even cool. I can't do that. I have to say, I've had a great day. I will be up early. Oh, let me not forget. I have a little challenge from um, Mr. Giles. Ray Giles. Somebody is bragging about doing two-a-days. And I said, so that sounds like a challenge to me because I'm really, really competitive. Little do people know. I'm very competitive. So I think we have a challenge going on for two-a-days. And we'll see. Do I want to take that up? No, there you go. I'm going to do my best to do as many as I can in the evenings as well. Let's see how that works. Again, I encourage you to keep pushing, keep shifting, and let's do it together. If you have any questions, comments, you know, please like the video, share it. And if you want to be a part of the challenge, let me know and I will make sure that I put links regularly in the video so you can share and join in as well. We are going from April 1st until May 1st. So our shift is happening.